Oh gosh, what do you, what do you need? I need some more volunteers from your tour group. Oh, you may have them pick. Yeah. yeah. Oh, I can do that. Excellent. All right. This time we're looking for two volunteers with video or still cameras that want to come up on stage, get a great photo of the owl. Hold your cameras really high. So lady, you, lady in the black with the sunglasses right here, and gentleman all the way in the back with the mustache and the uh, goatee. Yeah, you oh, too. right. All right. You Excellent. Too. You guys are going to head over there with Jane to the far stairway. While she's working on that, I'll tell the rest of you guys a few more things about owls. Now again, they may not be that intelligent, but great tools for survival. See, they have incredible eyesight, they have excellent hearing, and they have almost silent flight. That's what we're going to demonstrate next. All right, Jane, who do we have? We have Barbara and Justin. Let's hear for Barbara and Justin. Woo all right, Barbara, Justin, you guys are both going to have a seat right there. We have two still cameras. Okay, get them all turned on, ready to go. Here's what's going to happen. We're going to meet a beautiful owl. He'll come out from this window right here, fly nice and low out to Eric right back there, and then fly up here. So what you guys are going to do is focus your cameras in that direction. What you want to do is focus them right around here where my hand is. Maybe keep it on wide-angle lens so you can get the full wingspan. When I call the owl back up to stage, when you see him here, hit your shutters, and then you're both going to get great pictures right before impact. <laughs> oh, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. He's going to land on this stump right above your heads, and uh, he hardly ever misses. You'll be just fine. <laughs> no, of course he never misses. All right, volunteers are ready to go. We're going to meet our owl. His name is JJ. He's a great horned owl. There he is. Look out, guys. Ooh, he's Ooh. All right, looks like our volunteers are ready. JJ's ready. Here we go. Did you get it? Yeah? No? Come on over here, guys. Let's do this. Stand right next to me, guys, real quick. Stand right next to me. Turn around on this side, if you would. See if you can get a quick photo of him before he heads out. He'll look this way. There you go. You got a minute. And I think you both got it. Awesome. Big hand for our volunteers. You guys did a great job. Oh, God, Justin. So brave. Awesome. You're so brave. Very great. JJ is amazing. And, you know, owls are amazing. See, they help control rodent populations. Yeah, it's incredible. An owl the size of JJ could catch and eat something like 1,500 mice in one year. That explains it. I have not seen a mouse or a rat and a non poor in weeks. Yeah. yeah, it's true. Yeah, we used to be infested. Do you remember that? I, I do. I remember. Oh, thank heavens that rat problem is behind us now. Yeah. 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 Jane, speaking oh. of behind us, look how far away from the tree you are. Look how far away from my safe tree I am. Oh, I'm so glad I'm seeing some of the things I'm seeing. Oh, me too. Listen, you know, since you're feeling more comfortable, I'm thinking we should do something special for you. Oh, what? Well, you see, you missed our very first bird. What kind of bird was it? It's really neat. It was a trumpeter hornbill, and uh, we even had a volunteer, that young lady in the green shirt. She tossed a grape up in the air, and the bird caught it. Oh, I'm so sorry. I missed that. So here's what I'm thinking. Since you're feeling more comfortable, I can bring out a different kind of hornbill for you to meet. Oh, boy, that'd be swell. Yeah, and if you're young, you can work with a 